welcome back guys so today i'm going to be talking about two things that are very very dear to me um working as an actress filmmaker by day and as a tech consultant by night As you all know, if you um, know a bit about my history, you know that I worked in IT before I um, delved into um, the Nigerian entertainment industry, into filmmaking. And um, I did that for a number of years before I actually jumped ship. And um, it's something that I've always done. Um, never walked away from it because really and truly the truth is I feel that you need more than one skill to survive in life you need to be able to diversify into several different things you need to be good at a lot of different things um, that's just my philosophy <laughs> now you all know the situation of the Naira we know now 777 777 to the pound hey hey I don't know about you guys, but personally, I've got two homes. I've got one in the UK and I've got one in Lagos. And if you know about UK homes and you know about London living, the UK living, you know that you've got to pay. You've got monthly bills that you pay. It's not like Niger, where you pay your rent for the year and that's it. And um, I'm, I always have to change a certain amount of money to um, sort out these bills. And I looked at it and I said, ah. Ooh, this is not sustainable. 777 to the pound. It has, it's grown from 590 all the way to 777 in less than, in about a year. Look, speaking for myself, it's not sustainable. I, I feel like it's important to have multiple streams of income, um, which I actually do, but I feel like if I'm going to build to the point where I need to build and do things um, and like build on a much bigger scale, you're going to need <laughs> the resources, yeah, to do that building. Um, I mean, it's life's good as an actress, as a producer <laughs> and most recently director. Thank you. I feel like I can be building a lot more. And in order to get to where I need to be, I need, the, I need the resources to do a lot of stuff. And then there's also businesses that I want to delve into, which need foreign currency. The Naira cannot um, enable me to do those businesses. So if you're like me, who's constantly thinking of, you know, how to develop themselves, who's constantly thinking of the next thing to do, who's constantly thinking of, you know, the next project, you know, you're going to know that... Um, As you, as you think about the next project, as you think about um, the next big thing that you want to do, you know that, you, you, you know full well it's going to take some backing. One of the reasons why I'm actually doing this video is just to give you guys an insight into my life as a filmmaker and as um, an IT consultant. The good thing about these days is that a lot of the jobs are remote working or hybrid. Um, in my job, the job that I do right now is that um, I... I, I go into the office once or twice a week, but I'm predominantly um, at home. So, but like I said, this video is about giving you an insight into working in two different industries. Um, actress, producer, director, by day, and IT consultant, by night. So here, take a look. Here I am praying just before the camera rolls. Very important to commit it all to God. Then I call the shot, Action. directing my cast. Um, so here I am wearing the director cap. Well, then I you wear the actor cap, song. delivering those lines, delivering those emotions. I love it when I play a character that's got a lot of depth. Um, it makes you dig deep um, and it just gives you the opportunity to just go places that you don't really go. Um, the film is called Quandry and it's produced off the back of my other production company called Lavender Productions. Yep, so this is me, um, ripe and ready, heading to work, 
work shoes. These are my work shoes, the most comfortable things I've ever spent money on. I can wear them literally for ages. Out the door, to the bus stop, then the train station. Um, my work's literally, it's about um, one one stop. Yeah, one stop straight to work. And here I am, absolutely gorgeous, right in the thick of it, right in the middle um, of a number of different organisations. And my office is literally probably maybe less than a two minute walk from the train station um to my look at that beautiful um yeah so this is me um making my way like i said like a minute walk through the revolving doors i can't show you the building um where i work confidentiality purposes um my office is on the fourth floor before i start work i like to have a hot chocolate it just wakes me up and gets my brain powered up for the tasks I have ahead. Um, yep, and then at my desk, of course, drink my hot chocolate. <laughs> and then um, I check my emails, take a look at my task list, see what I have um, for the day. And then, of course, before you know it, it's lunchtime. But before that, quick toilet selfie for you guys. Um, and then I'm off to lunch. Usually for lunch, I like to just have a salad, nothing heavy don't want anything heavy that will put me to sleep so just um a salmon salad from prep um it does the work and keeps me fired up for the rest of the day and then before you know it it's time to go home (laughs) the best time of the day and then before I come out the building um the sun has set and just beautiful scenery um you know all around yeah this is me um I just keep it simple, nothing lavish, nothing too over the top to work. And then train station and I'm off home (sighs) after a long day at work. The good thing about this job is I get to work from home, say, maybe about a good 80 to 90 percent of the time. Um, It's really up to me how many days I want to, you know, I want to be in the office. But that's the good thing about this job. It's the remote working. But yeah, there you go. So there you go, guys. So that was me working an idea. And as you can see, I've set up my little office at home. So I work at home. You know, it's conducive. It's great. And I can't show you where I work confidentiality. I can't really tell you what I do and the projects that I work on. Um, But it's an amazing place. Um, Nobody recognizes me. Oh, no. The security guard, he um, he did. He reckoned. He said, and I had a face mask on. I think it was the name. I said my Nigerian superstar. I said, eh, 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 eh. Okay. So he said, no, no, go, 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 go. Uh-uh. Uh Well, this is. I mean, there's nothing wrong with people knowing who I am and what I do, or you know, my background or anything like that. But I just wanted to separate the two. But here you go, I'm doing this video today and um, it's just to tell you guys, encourage you to diversify, encourage you to have multiple streams of income and wherever you see an opportunity, you take it. There's lots of working home, uh, working from home opportunities. I'll see if, that, if I can find some links and post them um, in the description. And yeah, guys, thank you again for watching and always being there. And peace to you.